Welcome back to the channel guys. We are headed into Basking Ridge for another church rummage sale. Got stuck in traffic, got a little bit behind, but hoping to still secure a half decent place in line. <laughs> uh, I've never been to this one either, so let's go see what we can find. I'm going to go back here. Oh, I have no idea. Put your jewelry in here and hold it up here. Yes. Anything on these tables, we hold until you check it. Okay, take a look. I'm saying no, but you never know. Okay, okay. Excuse me. Is this for the clothes too? Because it says a lot. I don't. You know, kids. It's a lot. Does that mean the clothes also? Yes. No. No. Oh, yes. 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 I'm selling the whole lot. So okay. Not American Girl from over? Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. I'm going to keep looking around. Thank you. Excuse me. Ooh. Let's see if we might have some. Oh, those are Guinness. I thought it was a strategy guy. I might get that. It is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. some Royal Albert over here. I wasted time, but now I'm making up for it. Oh my goodness. Definitely wasted time over there. I know, that's okay, that's okay. It happens. Tina. Tina. Yep. We could leave it under there. Thank you. Get it, get it, uh, Thank you so much. I'm so excited by what I found so far. I need to tie my hair back. Excuse 
There were a couple of other American Girl dolls that I saw in the photos that I don't see here. Oh, excuse me. This is neat. This is really neat. Mango wood and enamel tray. The big shop. These are kind of cute. Three dollars. Lennox. That nutcracker is cute. Oh. I don't think I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna keep looking. Oh. Swiffer pads. Always need these. Little people, Disney. Get that. All kinds of stuff in here. I don't really time to dig through that though. I see. I have more hoops. So much to look at. Oh, excuse me. Mm. Oh, that's cool. Ocean Pacific. all the shoes, didn't I? Polo? Those aren't Ralph Lauren, are they? I don't know what size they are. I got those. Why not? Hmm. Kind of neat, Dolce Vita. Oh. Another polo pair. Um, check in sometimes inside. No, there's not on the bottom. Sometimes they're inside the. Yeah, I know. But oh, I right in here. Oh, oh, oh. It's right in there, but I can't quite read it. But yeah, always look under the straps. soft leather leather <laughs> 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 
No, 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 you can go. You can go. Right. Right. Excuse me, I'm coming around. Right. I'm going there. Oops. Would you mind if I slide through here? Thank yeah. you. Oh no, they're Lucky Brand. I don't know why that from a distance looks like that Patricia Nash symbol. There's some on clouds, it look kind of warm though. Beauty fridge? That's interesting. There's some games here. I don't know how much they are. Do you know how much these games are? Oh, no. That goes to that. The whole thing there is $40 for everything in that box. Oh, the whole thing is $40. Okay. Everything. But you got to buy it all. All right. Okay. I see. Okay. I don't think I'm going to do that. I haven't looked up the these lately. I don't even know how much they are worth lately. Okay. They're going to come around much. What do we have here? Linux Ivory Frost. <sighs> Everything I'd like to take out of the box, I can't because the price is on the box. <laughs> An empty Patron bottle. <laughs> this down because I have too much, too much in my arms right now. These are neat. Beaded coasters? They're really cool. Let me get those. Alright, I really need to dig into some of this stuff, I guess. You can't go wrong. Oh, these are drapes. Drapes, pillowcases. Chops. No, you're okay. You're okay. Thank you. Signs of a good rummage sale. The hair <laughs> and the half eaten baked goods. <laughs> Is Tina losing weight this yard sale season? 
it's not looking like it anyhow that was a good rummage sale my favorite pickup I grabbed in such haste that I did not realize it was broken until I got up to pay they ended up giving it to me for one dollar so we'll see if I can still make a ten dollar sale out of it I don't know let's go back to the warehouse and do the haul okay guys let's get into this church rummage sale haul it's a few days later but I think I have everything in front of me um this is how I've been filming my hauls I've been doing like all the shopping and whatnot and then I do all my hauls on Sunday and piece it together if you wonder why you see a lot of hauls with me wearing the same clothes. So, <laughs> um, anyway, total of $71 at this rummage sale. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. I really did. Um, I will say I have at least two things, four, three, three things that I don't have here. So I purchased two books for myself and um the swiffer the swiffer like floor pads i guess you would call them um they were four dollars but they um they're expensive in the stores the refill pads and i use those a lot like not to clean my entire floors but i use them for like spot cleaning throughout the you know week if the dogs have an accident or something spills or who knows you know I use them for that and I use a lot of them so picking them up all summer when I see them anyway let's get into the haul so $71 we're gonna start with this big big mess this was just a mess I like I said I grabbed this so fast not realizing that it was in total shambles <laughs> But you know what? I am still going to throw this up in auction and see if I can sell it for $10. That would be so funny. So they wanted three for it. I ended up getting it for one since it's all busted up. Let me give you a close up. Let me give you a close up of this handle. I don't even know. I guess you can see it. There's a crack here, a crack here, a crack here, a crack here. And I mean, it is cracked all the way through on both sides. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it definitely has a lot of, it has a lot of like regular imperfections. Like this is, this is an early Mackenzie Childs piece. Like it's definitely got, I think the painting was supposed to be that way, but there's just a lot of imperfections in this. Uh, then I noticed the lid was also chipped. So I was like, oh, maybe I can sell the lid. That's chipped too. I am. I'm just going to try to sell the whole thing. Um, 1990. 1990 Mackenzie Childs. This would have been so sweet had it not been broken and definitely repaired. I mean, look, you can actually hold that handle. It's been repaired. But man, <laughs> maybe if somebody wants this for display. So I'm still going to try to list it, as crazy as that may seem. Um, so I'll have to keep you updated on that. Anyway, then I got this Royal Albert Old Country Roses creamer and like a little tray. It is, um, it was sold together, but it's not meant to go together, I don't believe. But then again, maybe you could put like the sugar and the creamer here. I'm going to sell them separately because there's no sugar to it. I got one, two, three, four five six six lennox chirp solid dessert plates these do have some surface wear but nothing crazy these um sell from like 15 to 20 dollars a piece plus shipping i am probably just gonna lot these all together for a good amount and sell them that way i think they were five five dollars maybe for six plates I don't know. I'm not going to go through prices of everything. Like I said, 71 total. Then over in this box, I picked this up at the end. I was digging through some clothes. This wasn't on camera. This is a champion reverse weave size small. It looks like the, um, the neck was cut.
cut off. It's very, very worn. Northeastern University, very, very worn. But I might get $20 for this. Um, I got an Ikea twin set, like pink triangles, new in the package. Oh, I picked up these coasters. I just thought these coasters were super cool. Now, they're certainly not going to catch any kind of, um, like, if there's, you know, water on your cup or, or whatever. It's not going to protect your furniture. But look how cute these are. These beaded, there goes that one. These beaded coasters. And there's one, two, three, six of them. Six of them in here. I guess these were probably handmade. I don't know. I just think they're super cool. And then in this box, I got some Lennox two plates, two salad plates, four small plates. So it looks like the bird plates, maybe. Oh no, they're all different sizes. Saucers too. Anyway, this is, I figure you can't go wrong. It does have a little bit of wear, but for Lennox, Ivory Frost, I feel like $4 was just a really good deal on all that. And then into the final bag. Ooh final bag here I got this OP um it's kind of got a weird I guess that's adjustable maybe it slides oh it does it slides I've never seen one like that I think this is vintage yeah it's definitely vintage so I picked that up Ocean Pacific uh I got this little people Cinderella and Prince Charming new in package i have some large bowls in here <laughs> these are it looks like chang's i'm gonna have to look into these but i really like the koi fish there's the bottom chang's i really like the koi fish these are huge bowls i don't know if these are serving bowls or what they are i am gonna it looks like they pulled these right out of their sink or their dishwasher and said, hey, let's just get rid of these. Let's donate these to the rummage sale after we ate out of them. These are actually a hot mess. I gotta clean those up. Holy moly. Okay. I grabbed this, thought maybe it was gonna be worth something. It's really not. So that was kind of a fail, but the paperbacks were 50 cents. So it's not like I'm losing a ton of money on it. Uh, and then this one I did pay up for this Disney $6 for a Disney t-shirt. I should have left this behind, but I grabbed it. It is new with tags being together is magical. Uh, so this is, uh, what is it? It's a U.S. extra large. And then I got this, this is great smoky mountains just a t-shirt that I was thinking about keeping for myself just to wear around. Um, and then this will get listed. This is a life is good size small. It's a crusher tee, um, new with tags, little snowman on there. And then we got some shoes. So I got these John Lewis and partners. I don't I don't know if these are going to be good. It says made in Spain, John Lewis and Partners. It's kind of a weird label to put on your shoe. It sounds like um like a law firm. <laughs> a law firm that started a shoe line, John Lewis and Partners. Um call us for your next arraignment. I don't know. Who knows, but these uh is that even call us for your next arraignment i don't know call us for your next crime who knows whatever these whatever this law firm i just made up is doing but anyway <laughs> anna patent loafer size 39 made in spain so we'll see i didn't even look those up i figured i'll give them a shot these are a lucky brand pair of ballet flats we have polo new size seven they do in fact look new um polo i don't see a ralph lauren thing on them but they're called the knot slide so we'll see about those 
then I did pick up these polo and these do say polo Ralph Lauren. Uh, these are another size seven. So yeah, they're probably, they probably were owned by the same person. These blue sandals slides. I got a pair of Piccolinos, little wedge, wedge heel, pretty good condition. Uh, and then I got a pair of Merrell's air cushion Q form. They almost look like the barefoot kind, but they're not. And lastly, uh, this pair of Fly Londons. Ooh, there's a bunch of mud in this one. To scrape that out. Look at that. But yeah, these are kind of neat. I wonder, I think these are probably like an older style. I, I've never seen this style of Fly Londons. They have this metal thing around the front that says Fly London, which I think is really cool. Um, so yeah not not too shabby on those i like these i think they're funky i think they're really cool um so yeah i think it was a pretty decent rummage sale haul uh i really i really enjoyed that sale i wish i wouldn't have uh, messed around too long in the beginning with that american girl doll stuff because who knows what else i would have found uh anyway um yeah that's gonna wrap it up guys thank you so much for watching hope you've enjoyed this video um I'll be back with more rummages, yard sales, flea markets, and all that good stuff. The season's really kicking off. So yeah. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you've liked this video, hit that thumbs up button. It helps the channel. Uh, comment and subscribe if you haven't done so already. So you get a little notification every time I upload, upload a new video. And until next time, bye.